Assalamualaikum. Hi. Okay, now I would like to share you how to answer question number 10. Okay, the variable x and y are related by the equation of y equals to 5 power of x over 4. So, the diagram 11 here shows the straight line obtained when the log, 10, log base 10 y is plotted against x. Okay, so this is the diagram 11 here. Okay, so the question asks you to find two, que two questions about the first one. A. Express the equation in its linear form used to obtain the straight line graph in diagram. So, it means that you have to uh, make this equation y equals to 5 power of x uh, over 4 to the linear form. And the second one, find the value of h and k. So, this is your h here, the x coordinate or x intercept here. And your k now is y intercept. Okay, so are you ready? So, let's... we. Uh, learn how to answer this question okay the first one we want to answer question a okay so we have y equals 5 power of x over 4 and we know that we have the log here so means that i have to multiply all this equation with log base 10 okay so now what we have so we have the log base 10 y equal the log base 10 5 power of x over 4. So we multiply the both side, uh, right hand side and left hand side. And for this right hand side, you have to remember that what have you learned in the log rules, log form. Okay, so this is divide. So I have to expand this one by minus. Okay, so do you still remember? Oh, sorry, this is power of x. And then now, I have x, we remove, okay, to the in from here. So, I have log base 10, 4. And now, when we have for this one, I would like to change this into the log base 10, 5, multiply x minus log base 10 4 because i want to compare with our general linear equation which is y equals to mx plus c so now you can see clearly okay so your y your x your gradient and your c and this is uh, the answer for this question Okay, express the equation in its linear form to uh, obtain for the straight line graph there. Okay, so how you know that? Okay, because from here, this is our y and this is our uh, apple, uh, x axis, uh, y axis and x axis. Okay, same lah now. Okay, so next we want to find our H and K. So normally, for question B here, okay, so uh, let's we label first. Your K is your C or is, is equals with Y intercept. And your H is your X intercept. Okay, how to find this one? Okay, first, let me see what we have here. Um, M. Uh, we have our M here. Okay. Uh, this is our M. So, we can find our M now. So, M is equals log base 10, 5. Which is your M is equal... Um, oh, okay. Wait. So first, before I find our M... Okay. We have the value for C here, what intercept, see? Uh, C is the negative log base 10, 4. So, means that we find C first, sorry. Okay, so C, it is our Y intercept. And it is also equal with the value of K here, okay? So, 0, oh, calculate first. Negative log base 10, 4. So, K equal 
negative 0 0.6021 so this is answer for k and when we have our k and we can continue to find our m which is our m is equal um, 0 minus k over um, h minus 0 okay and our m is actually is equals log base 10 5 and we can find our h now because we got the value k already so this is negative 0 0.2 what oh sorry okay teacher remove k so uh, log base 10 5 equal 0 minus 0 0.6021 okay h okay so h minus 0 is h lah. and then h equal this is a positive 0 0.21 divide uh, log base 10 we have 0 point um, 6 9 8 9 so our h are equal with 0 0.8614 okay and this is our k negative 0 0.6 0, 2, 1. Okay. So, I got the answer. Here's it. Oops, sorry. Better dah soalan yang pertama tadi. Okay. So, now. This question is about the equation y equals to 5 power of x over 4. Okay, you have to express the equation to the linear form obtained for this graph. And we can see that for this graph, the y axis here is about log base 10 y and the x axis here is x. So when I change this uh, equation, I have to make sure my y quantity my y axis is log base 10 y and my x axis or x quantity is x so when we rearrange this one and for how to get the log base 10 here i multiply with the log base 10 for the both side right hand side and left hand side and then we rearrange follow to the uh, loss of log and then divide log here when we expand we got a uh, subtraction and then this one, I rearrange to the linear form. This is y equals to mx plus c. So I can compare now our y axis, our x axis, our gradient and our y intercept. So now, when we have our c is our y intercept, it is actually our k from this diagram. So we got uh, the k is equals to negative log base 10 4. So we calculate using calculator, we got negative 0 0.6021. And how to find our h? This is actually, we can compare with the gradient because we know our gradient now is log base 10 5. So we use the formula m equals to 0 minus k over h minus 0. And I substitute the value and I compare. And lastly, I got h is 0 0.6. 8614. Okay, so this is how to answer for this question. I hope with this, uh, my explanation uh, helps you to understand clearly how to answer this question. Okay, bye. See you next question.